My name is Dylan Mahern. I'm the operations manager here at Ultra Surfaces here in Stockton, California. We specialize in countertop fabrication and installation for commercial, residential, and new home development. Today we're working on the project for Obsidian Industrial Fabrication process. We're going through their commercial desk. We're going to be showing you the final process of etching it into the actual physical piece that's going to be heading into his office. The tools we're using are made by Vincent Tool. We're going to be using a PCD writing bit and a single pass grooving bit, typically used for etching drain boards into countertops, but we're going to be using it to fine tune the Obsidian Industrial logo. First, we set up a template date. We met at Obsidian's warehouse and we measured the desk. We went over seam layouts and how we can maximize material yield using our Sabre Jet provided by Park Industries. We measured them, plugged those numbers into the Titan that is also by Park Industries, and we started running test pieces and fine tuning them. We brought the tools here to the shop and we plopped them on some, some cones, which are what hold the tools in place for the CNC. We put them in the AccuSet after that and measured the length and diameters, plugged those into the machine, and then started running some tests, fine-tuned how we wanted the logo to look. One of the problems we ran into was that we were spacing the passes too far apart, so we started to bring them tighter and tighter together. We did a couple experiments using acrylic fill, and it just didn't quite meet our expectations. So we turned to a paint and we realized that that was more efficient and it produced a better product, making the logo pop a bit more. It's pretty badass what, what those tools can do. I mean, I never knew my CNC could do that. You know, it, it's a big machine doing little fine things. And, you know, I can offer drain boards to my customers and I can make a little extra money and be a little bit more profitable at the end of the day. Diversify myself from my competition.